is your weekly campus news report. I'm Alexandra Ferragamo. And I'm Ida Inelayekwis. A new fraternity is making its way onto campus. Phi Delta Theta is looking to become the 12th Greek organization to join the LIU community. Alex Atkinson, a representative from Phi Delta Theta, said joining the fraternity will give students a new opportunity to stand out and lead with purpose. It will also allow for individuals to take what they learn in the classroom and apply it within a real-life business experience. Phi Delta Theta has been operating for over 170 years and has expanded to over 275 campuses, initiating more than 270,000 men. Students have showed interest in possibly joining the organization. Jordan Giugiano, a junior history major, said that he's excited about possibly joining because the fraternity would not have any established traditions yet, which would make it a laid-back environment. Phi Delta Theta will begin recruiting on campus this semester with the hopes of establishing a chapter by next semester. Interested students can contact Atkinson at atkinson at phideltatheta.org for more information. The campus's eSports arena has been moved. Previously located in Hillwood 226, the arena is now housed in Hillwood 259. The new room sports six gaming PCs and a pair of couches students can sit on while they wait for computers to become available. According to John McDermott, the coach of the eSports teams, the move was made due to the popularity of the eSports program. Students such as Maquisha Thierry Gallet, a sophomore business management major and member of the campus's Fortnite team, say they are enjoying the new room because it allows for spectators to watch the games and gives them more space to hang out with their teammates. The new room isn't receiving universal praise, however. Tim McTire, a senior game design major and vice president of the eSports club, says that the new room has potential but issues such as the number of computers available need to be addressed. The Wave radio station is hosting a Galentine's Day event to celebrate female empowerment and friendship. Originally inspired by the sitcom Parks and Recreation, Galentine's Day is an annual tradition invented by the character Leslie Nope to celebrate female friendship and enjoy decadent breakfast foods. The event will be held in the end zone on Thursday, February 13th where two films, 10 Things I Hate About You and For a Good Time, Call, will be shown from 7 p.m. to 11 p.m. Everyone that comes to see the showings will receive complimentary popcorn and a goodie bag. There will also be an ice cream bar and other snacks available for purchase. Members of the field hockey and football teams volunteered at Night to Shine, an annual prom celebrating the lives of people with special needs and how unique they are. Volunteers spent the night as someone's prom date, enjoying all of the activities the venue had to offer together. Michaela Zuckerby, a sophomore sports management major who volunteered at the event, said, It was amazing. I paired with a boy named Peter, and it was such a fun night. We danced the night away, had a great dinner, and had some great conversations about our interests and hobbies. Like most proms, Night to Shine featured a crowning ceremony to award the titles of prom king and queen, but with a slight twist. In this prom, all of the guests were crowned kings and queens. That's all the news we have for today. I'm Ida Inelayekvist. And I'm Alexander Ferragamo. Have a great day and we'll see you next week.